Hey guys, Goji Pie here, and welcome back to Dead Space. This is going to be the final chapter and the final part to this series, and then we're done. And we can move on to the other games I need to finish, like Maritime Bay and all that shit, which will be uploaded soon. But here we go. Only a heal. Alright, time to get this marker off. It says it's offline. Oh, I do. Says it's offline. Okay. Oh, I got it. I gotta remember because I did play this game. I just gotta. Just gotta bring this thing over here. This is taking forever. Isaac, go faster. Come on, man. Hey, you got it. Alright. Debate it. And, uh, yeah. There it is. The marker. That's been making us go crazy, I'm guessing. Or people are so crazy about this. Take it away. We just gotta deliver it to the where we found it. Well, where they found it, and then that's it. Get on there. There we go. I'm gonna go in here real quick. Oh, they're dead. Isaac, the marker needs to be returned to the pedestal chamber. Use the loader to bring it there and place it on the pedestal. I got it. There's some stuff in here I can grab. This is Sergeant Newman, PSEC. We've lost all the shuttles. One of them just took off and came straight back down and crashed into the bay. Took a couple of hundred people and all the remaining shuttles with it. If anyone can hear this, do not land. Do not land. Oh, shit. Diamond. Gold. I sold that. Not enough. Buy some shit. Alright, that'll do. Should be good. The thing is alive in there, I'm assuming. I fucking killed them. So they were still alive. But anyways, I uh come on. I just need this. That's all I need guys. I just needed that. Fuck, I hate this fucking thing. Oh, 
fucking hate these face hugger bitches. I keep missing my shots, and that's why I hate them. See, they're so annoying. I cannot hit them. Those ones are the most annoying. I pretty much wasted a lot of ammo on those fuckers. Let's do this. Wait. Where's my battery thing at? Plug that in first. Let's go. Let's do this. Deliver this marker to where it needs to go. Charge my Stadius here. Right, slow the bridge down. God damn it. I'm gonna kill these fuckers first. It looks like I opened a power node. Ah, fuck these stupid bitches. Oh my god, these things are so annoying! And how many are there? Please tell me your last one so I can kill you. There's 
not get in. have like two fucking stacks left because i was shooting all these fuckers this was a power no door and i'm hoping ammo holy fuck this will help it's four stacks that works okay, we're not supposed to go this way though but that helps we got ammo More health can help. So let's do this. I don't know how far we're in to like bringing this thing back. Up. Oh, there's a shop, store, that's kind of cool. Are you gonna like bring your tentacle out? Cross. I think the power's out. my shit oh free ammo thank you still do four stacks oh, shut up oh i go through there i can't go through the store at least Sold that. Buy some more ammo. Save some of my credits for later. All right. All right, let's go through here, fix what I need to fix. That's zero gravity. Entering zero gravity. I could just walk like this. I don't have to jump. Maybe I'm gonna have to. Oh, I'm just gonna run. I 
jump. I have to jump through that. Alright, I'm in. through. Just gotta slow the fans down and we can just run right through these. Big boy. It did not hurt me. Activate my bridge. Come on, go through. more to go through and then we can just send it in I got enough shit for a while this is it I don't need that power node. Fuck it. Good thing I can grab it. Oh, fucking bridge. Good news is we made it. And I think the good news is we're close to delivering it where it needs to be. See? It's right there. In fact, it's, I don't know what it says. I can't read. There it is. You just need to deliver it over there. Shit! I didn't even know that was gonna happen. Oh shit, I almost died.
right. This isn't gonna be too hard. I just need to take those tentacles out. Now I can deliver this fucker. There's one left. Deliver it. Let's do this. and attacks me. Come on. Jesus. I always believed in you. I knew you'd return to me. We are whole again, Isaac. We are whole. Holy shit, I feel like we're gonna... She's gone. We gotta get out of here now. I did my job! Watch out. I have enough. All right, we're gonna uh, we're gonna get out of here at least. You're a bitch. Why you gotta do this? This whole time she was actually dead. Oh, this whole time, Nicole was actually dead. Kind of insane. Imagine if you were playing this in 2008 you were shocked the whole time that you were hallucinating. This whole time, it was just a hallucination. 
Well, this is it. Time to finish what we started. Oh, damn. He tricked a little bit. And basically here, it's preparing you for what's about to come. What's about to happen. Go to the shop real quick. Just let's check something out. I pretty much have three, six, I have seven stacks of it. Just buy one thing. All we gotta do is get back to the shuttle. Oh, she ain't surviving today. She's just dead. She didn't even last that long. When I first played this game, I was shocked that I had to fight probably one of the best bosses in any game I played. When I saw that, I was like, how the fuck am I going to kill that? Well, the answer is right there in front of you. Take the damage. Now here, when I when I when I when I saw this happen, I thought I was screwed and I died. But I wasn't. It's part of it. Motherfucker, this is why I like Isaac. He just gets right back up, even if he's a normal human. We're missing. Come on. Ah, oh, you missed. Everyone says this boss battle is too easy, and I will admit it is. But I think it's one of the best boss battles I've ever seen. Or one of the best bosses. And surprising, no necromorphs have appeared on me. They usually would. Surprised I haven't gotten hit once. Usually I've gotten hit multiple times in this battle. So far I haven't gotten hit. Alright, open up. They got one more left. The thing that's so surprising is that when you're fighting this boss battle, there's a meteor about to hit this planet that's going to destroy it. And I here I am fighting this fucking thing. And any time it could happen. But I don't think it will.
Here it is. We have killed it. Killed it. It's over. Now we gotta get on board. We just left the marker behind. Like, fuck it. No one cares. Just leave. There's the meteor. And boom. That meteor would have killed us. Finally get to see what Isaac Clark looks like in the game. This is the first time you get to see his face. In the beginning, you just see the back of his head. You don't really get to see what he looks like. And right there, folks, was Dead Space. And I'm going to say this. This is honestly one of the best games I've played in all my life. It has to be in, like, my, one of my top ten favorite games. Like, you gotta admit, for 2008, you gotta admit, this game was impressive back then. I've never played this game in 2008. I've heard about it, but I never saw any gameplays about it. Until I bought the game on Xbox 360. Well, technically Xbox One S or Xbox Series, whatever. I bought it on the Xbox Store. Tried it out. Played the first game. And I would say I played it through one sitting. And I was just impressed about how good this game was. And how did the fuck did I miss this game out? And then I moved on to the sequel, which is Dead Space 2. Which I will be doing videos on that soon. I sat through that whole game with one sitting through one sitting as well. And I'm gonna say the sequel was fucking amazing. Then there's Dead Space 3. I played it on Xbox, but I just got uninterested in the game and I never finished it on Xbox. So when I get it on PC, I played through the whole thing on PC and I'm gonna say it, I love Dead Space 3. I think all the Dead Space games are good. There are some Dead Space games on the Wii. There is one on the Wii, and there's another one, and there's a mobile game. But, for the first three Dead Space games, they were fucking good. The first two are masterpieces, in my opinion. Dead Space 3, not a masterpiece, but it would have been if it wasn't for the microtransactions and all that shit. Story was alright for it. Just everything else wasn't the greatest, but it's, all, it's still good. Yeah, that's pretty much what Dead Space is, folks. I really had a fun time. I know it's been a year since I did a for the video, but uh, yeah, this was this was great. I'm really excited for the remake that's going to be coming soon. I'm going to be playing the remake. It's going to be the first game just remade. Because it's kind of funny. I played this game in 2020 and uh. Wasn't expecting a remake, and when I heard there was going to be one, boom, I was excited. If I played this game sooner or later, like in 2008, I probably would have been fucking even surprised. Now, in the remake I want to talk about is that Isaac Clark is going to be speaking in the remake. So, that's kind of surprising. Uh, I will admit, usually I'm the kind of guy that likes silent protagonists. Like, he plays the silent character. Such as, like, you know, 
Doom guy is a silent character. He never speaks. He never speaks in any of the Doom games. Except in Doom Eternal. He finally, we finally get to hear what he says. Or speaks, whatever. Dead Space 2, Isaac Clark has a... He finally speaks in that one. He talks. It's kind of weird he didn't talk in this one. He's just, like, silent. But kind of like that. You just don't know anything about him. You just know he's just an engineer trying to survive. And that's the thing I love about this game. Is that you're not like a... Isaac Clark isn't like some military man who knows how to use any guns. I mean... He's using a fucking plasma cutter as a tool. And he's using it to kill these necromorphs. He is not just a military man. He is literally just an engineer trying to survive. That is lo what I love. I am not... I'm, I'm gonna be honest. As military characters you play as i kind of did like that it, you're not playing as the military character you're playing as a guy that's trying to survive with just being an engineer and surviving off these tools that are plasma cutters pulse rifles all that pulse rifle is a gun but still and i only use the plasma cutter through my playthrough because there is an achievement just to play it with the only using one gun which is the plasma cutter and I already did that. But yes. Overall, enjoyed it. But. Oh, I could have just skipped it. And there it is. Now, there is a secret message for the first. For all the chapters in the letter. And they all say. Nicole is dead. Save my game. And we did it. And now it just says clear game. And that's it. Now if I go to new game, there's impossible. That's good. Sadly, there's no extras except concept art you can look at. But it's just videos. So there's nothing really to do. Turn the volume down for some reason, that kind of sucks. So, that is Dead Space, guys. Fucking fantastic game. Recommend it. Even if you've never played it before, please play it. I recommend it. And as always, I will have to say this, but uh, thank you so much for watching. Really fun game. I'm going to be playing the remake and sequels soon. I'll be playing Dead Space 2 soon, but not now. I'll probably play it after I play the remake. That comes out in January. I probably can do the sequels real quick. But uh, yeah, this was great. I hope you guys enjoyed the Dead Space series. Even though they don't get my truce, I don't mind. But thank you so much for watching. And as always, leave a like, comment, and subscribe down below. And as always, I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.